what are some tips to reduce the chance of getting prostate cancer? Stay tuned and find out. Specifically today, tips to reduce the chance of getting prostate cancer. Uh, we got four of them today. Let's get into it. I'm always on the phone because <laughs> why not? Technology. Uh, all right. Tip number one is something that all men like to do, and I like to do it as often as possible. You got to ejaculate frequently. So you gotta get those rocks off whenever you get a chance. Hey, you know, you know what they say, nobody does it like me, or you, or whoever may be doing it. Either way, get your rocks off. So, stop and talk to you real quick. Hey. An Australian study found that uh, DIY sex may help prevent prostate cancer. The study of 2,338 men showed that guys who masturbated five or more times per week were 34% less likely to develop prostate cancer by age seven. It's pretty good. There's another tip that I didn't know. Seminal foods contain substances that are carcinogenic. So regular ejaculation may help flush them out. And as we all know, carcinogens are bad. So, you know, flush yourself by pleasing yourself. Tip number two, while doing it yourself works, it's always much more fun with a partner. So, uh, you know, have safe sex and uh, You really shouldn't need a whole lot of motivation to have safe sex. You know, with all the things they got going around these days, I don't think I'd tell you what's going around. I'm gonna put the link to uh, these tips in the description. Cause really, they got a lot of scientifically uh, renowned words. I don't know. I can't pronounce them, I just butcher it. Um, another tip number three, is uh, a good one and I myself can use it and I'm sure a lot of other people could too. You gotta lose some weight. Um, let's see. Stop right here and talk to you for a minute. It says, uh, now I found these on men's health. Um, so, like I said, I'll put the link to it in the description. But uh, let me talk to you real quick. Years of uh, research clearly shows that extra body weight is associated with an increased cancer risk include aggressive forms of prostate cancer. So, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna take a stab at it and say the heavier you are, the more aggressive your cancer could be. So, lose that weight. <sighs> Tip number four, it's the last one I got for you today. You gotta exercise, and what better way to exercise than to do it for a cause? Not only yourself, but men's health. Donate to the Movember Foundation. Ha <laughs> ha! Um, it says that uh, research shows that staying active might prevent prostate cancer. Um, it says that uh, exercise and maintaining a healthy weight are two of the single best ways to reduce your prostate cancer risk. Not bad. So, get out there and walk, run, ride a bike, row a boat, whatever gets you active. Um, I said I started walking when I joined the Movember Foundation. And you got, you know, you walk 
60 miles uh, for the 60 men that we lose each hour to um, suicide, testicular cancer, prostate cancer, and uh, just trying to raise awareness for mental health. Make sure you uh, like the video for the November Foundation or men's health in general, or just because you like the video. Um, definitely share it with um, everyone you know because some of the tips might just help somebody else. Um, I'd like you to subscribe to the channel and um, I'd really, really like you to donate to the November Foundation. There's links in the description right there. Um, if you want to do your own research on the uh, Movember Foundation, that link is also in the description. And, um, thanks for uh, tuning in to uh, some tips. I might, uh, I might just do this on a regular basis. I think actually men's health is very important to get out there. I mean, Yes, it's a motor vlogging channel, but you can't ride a bike, you can't ride a motorcycle, and you can't motor vlog if you're dead. You know, if you're sitting up there 10, 12 hours a day getting your radiation treatment or chemotherapy, you know, how are you going to ride? You're too weak to hold up your bike. You can't twist the throttle. Man's health is important no matter what you do. So, I'm gonna start doing this on a regular basis. Um, maybe, I won't give you an actual date though. On a regular basis. Make sure to uh, leave a comment down below if you know of, or going through, or just wanna talk about anything um, related to the November Foundation, uh, men's health, and um, whatever I don't know, I'm sure we can work together to uh, find an answer to so um, yeah leave a comment really like to talk to you thanks for tuning in